And I seen how they lied, and they waited for my rhyme. Those poor bastards waiting on the ground. And all I could do was climb on the stage and say what was in my fucking heart. And that was our God is an awesome God. He reigns from heaven on down, he says, with a butt plug up his ass. Our God is an awesome God. He reigns. From heaven on down to earth, there is no something other but our God. Our God is an awesome rain, even though he couldn't save himself. And it kind of was a wimp, but our God, our God is an awesome God. A wimpy Jew carpenter. Leading all of us astray, but our God is an awesome God. He reigns. Whether he gets butt fucked or not, whether he has femi hair or not, our God is an awesome God. He reigns. <laughs> I'm here to win it, and if anybody wants to take it away from me, they... Dude, for the love of your grandchild, will you lose some fucking weight? You better bring it. I smoked the chicken, I pulled the chicken, put it in the gumbo. It's just cooking right now to let all the flavors blend and come... Again, obesity is killing Western civilization. Everybody's like, oh, it's okay, oh, it's okay. No, it's fucking not. This guy should be in the gym. Or at least a routine workout should be part of his day. Again, the guy looks like he has a little granddaughter. I'm sure he, she loves him very much. And if you love her, old man, get into better shape. Come together. And yeah. I realize I'm 41 and I'm fat, but keep in mind, I've already lost 20 pounds, and now I'm going to kick up my weight loss efforts with exercises. And I'm Priscilla Hunt, and, and we're, we're Home, home Grill Advantage. Advantage. We started competing in barbecue in 2020. Home Grill Advantage isn't the only contender uh, behind the top prize. All right, I got my Rizzo already going, and I already put my meat and my Trinity in there. Six o'clock in the morning, over here, Pro Bridge, Louisiana. Oh, hell got the no, brisket hell on. no. Just... This is another reason. This is another reason why I'll never be defeated. Let's say, let's say actual Jake really does make his living doing Twitch. The dude broadcasts roughly, what, 9 to 15 hours a week. And my 15 is being very, very fucking generous. Do you know if I can make $100 an hour on Twitch, do you know what my response would be? Son of a bitch. I just figured out how to make $1,300 a day. That's why you're never going to beat me, Jake. You cannot fight me. You cannot work me. Again. When I was in kickboxing class, I was the only 13, 14 year old there. And even they said, why the hell do you keep attacking? It's like, you're going to either you're going to knock my ass out. Or I'm taking you down. I'm not going to stop. 
And that's the difference. Even if Jake does make, let's say, legitimately $100 an hour when he streams. And look, I'm... I'm going to cast big doubt on that, but again, I don't know his finances. I'm not as, I'm not as accountant. But Jake thinks, oh, all I have to do is nine, nine hours of work a week. And then I can fuck off and do whatever else I want. I sit there and go... Now I can make nine hundred. Now I can make fucking eleven hundred dollars a day or twelve hundred dollars a day. Jesse, put it on the job. Chicken turn in time is less than an hour away, but Ben and Jonathan over at JBQ are struggling to get their chickens up to temp. I'm a little bit a little nervous. More, a little more comfortable. By the way, if anyone's wondering, this is why I don't uh, go into competitive barbecue. I like doing shit my way and on my timetable. Like they were saying they were having a little problems with the, getting the chicken temperature up. A lot of that is probably, you know, it's normally 60, 70, 80 degrees outside. It's cold. Ooh, nice smoke. What you guys, what, what did you guys use? Uh, pecan. It's pecan. Yeah. Really nice. Yeah. Little sweet, little background. All righty. Um, oh, next turn. Look, I'm tired. I'm beat up. We'll do, we'll, we'll do this again tomorrow. Good night, everybody.